Hi everyone, I'm Fanny from Digital One. Today's live stream is a little bit different. I will be live streaming from our digital 2020 learnings you need to heed heading into 2021 event. This event takes place in this 3D virtual immersive world on Verbella. I will share my Verbella screen with you. I'm in the campus in the welcome area right now. So let me share that with you. Here I am with the Santa hat, the Christmas hat right now. Okay, so you can access the world, this 3D immersive world through your computer or your laptop, um, not a smartphone or a tablet. This only works on a computer or a laptop. As the world experiences a historic and dramatic shift, businesses need to be capable of delivering experiences if delivering exceptional digital experiences, having a strategic vision and plan for what's next will be key for leaders in a new digital age. So we're going to head to the conference hall now for the virtual networking and registering portion of the event. So all I have to do is click go to, uh, and I am on live streaming right now. So this is the conference hall where you can see the room is decorated with Kaojun's latest artwork. Uh, People coming to this event will be heading here first to register if they haven't and to do a little bit early networking. But the events uh, will be starting shortly. So I'm gonna take back upstairs to the, the Digital 2020 VR Center. So to head there, we're gonna click go to and select private team suite. You will need a passcode to enter the private team suite. So once you have purchased your ticket, you have registered, you will be emailed the passcode. So I already have it saved here. So let's get going and press submit. So here we are in the digital 2020 event. Um, we are very fortunate and honored to have greeting messages from our Canadian government. Uh, we have our Prime Minister, Justin Trudeau. Let's get a little bit closer. We have it from our uh, BC Premier, Premier of British Columbia, Mr. John Horgan. We also have a greeting message from our Mayor, Mayor of Vancouver, um, Mr. Kennedy Stewart. Here are just an excerpt of what they have wrote in their greeting message and letter to us. Uh, from the Prime Minister, the COVID-19 pandemic has been has made planning and hosting events like this especially difficult. That is why he would like to thank the dedicated organizers for making this conference virtual so that it can still take place. From our premier, from a 3D virtual space to connect and collaborate to online classes and an array of speakers, he has no doubt that this is an event to remember. He applauds you, our dedication in finding such an ingenious way of bringing the tech sector together. And from our mayor as mayor, he wants to congratulate each and every one of us for our commitment to making a difference in our community. Hi. Hi. Hi, good, how are you? Hi, Lakala, hi, Min. Yeah, well, uh, it's amazing, huh? I, I see the, you know, Prime Minister, you know, minister and the mayor and the governor, BC governor, right? Uh, BC premier. <laughs> yes, okay. Slightly different words in Canada. <laughs> but <laughs> same. Okay. So, premier. Premier, okay. Premier. <laughs> premier. okay. All right. So what this picture is about? Uh, so we have some greeting messages from our Canadian government about our events that's happening right now. And they're just like showing their support and uh, greeting all the people that are attending. And we're very fortunate to get these messages from them and we appreciate their their uh, appreciation, their support. And um, well, yes, actually- yes. Well, uh, I mean, all this, you know, officer, you know, top leader can, and really massive. So this is, this has to be and must be a very successful event, right? Yes, we're very excited. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for saying that. 
Um, so welcome to our 3D uh, virtual world. This is the Digital One VR Center. Uh, could I give you a little quick tour about uh, this place? Oh, yes, of course. Sure. Um, yes. OK. Yes, let's... please. I will uh, you know, let uh, all of my audience to, uh, to look around after sure. you. All right, so come follow me. I'm going to take you up to reception. <laughs> All right, so here we are. This is, we are in an immersive 3D world for work, learning, and virtual events right now. So today we're going to find out more. So let's have a quick tour of this office. If you'll follow me, uh, we have in here. So we have each of these offices holds uh, one of our brands that we have on our iCash Rewards website that we uh, have in uh, that you can shop from. So each of these brands, uh, you can see inside the office what they are and also on top. So this one here is Indigo. And in the, oh, yeah. it's a, it's a, it is a famous brand, right? Yeah, this is a very famous. Uh, it's a Canadian brand even. Um, and we want people to come here, take a look at their brands, take a look at some of the products that we've created the images for. And if you go inside, it's already preloaded with their website so that people can come here and shop and they can shop in several different rooms with several different brands at the same time. So um, I'm going to I mean, take- uh, yeah? anyone? Does anyone has to come here or just go to your website? Uh, they can come here just to kind of get a more of um, kind of off online, offline shopping experience. They can do it alone on the on our website at home, but they'd be alone. But here, there's other people here as well. So if they have any questions, they're uh, free to ask our staff. Okay, so uh, you mean some some you know staff from the company? Uh, we'll be here presenting the product, right? Yeah, uh, we will be here to help with uh, them to okay, learn. Cool. Okay, yeah. okay. All right, so let's yeah, go down here. Oh, sorry. Oh, we're going to show you this boardroom over here. This is a boardroom, okay. 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 Uh, this is our boardroom. So in here, if you'd like to come in. In here is, uh, earlier you saw those images of the greeting messages from our Canadian government. In here we actually have the videos of their messages. So you can uh, view them, you can play them at your leisure. So whenever you want. Um, I don't want to take up too much of your time, so I'm just going to play a simple one, maybe this one here. On the main screen, if you zoom in, is our Prime Minister. On the mm -hmm. right web screen one is our Premier, uh, John Horgan. So I can just quick, play quickly. Yep. From Premier John Horgan. As Premier of the Province of British Columbia, I am pleased to extend greetings to everyone attending the virtual appreciation event for those involved with Digital 2020, shape the future of our new remote economy. The tech sector is one of BC's fastest growing industries. Its success comes from the inspirational and innovative ideas of the people who call this province home. Digital 2020 brought together students, young professionals and entrepreneurs to share the latest developments in the areas of robotics, artificial intelligence okay, that's cool. and so, virtual uh, reality. I mean, every audience come here and they can play the video by themselves, right? Yeah, they can come here, they can play the video uh, as they want. Uh, we have the three greeting messages on the side here. And then the back of the wall here, we have um, a video about Kaojun's latest uh, artwork in collaboration with uh, the Rockefeller family. Well, wow, that's cool. I'll, I'll, I'll come back next time to give a special, you know, visit, you know, on this side. Okay. Yeah, for sure. Um, let me take you back outside again. Yes. So this area is just um, a little area here. We host um, 
a small cocktail, like a small cocktail gathering before the actual uh, formal reception begins. So people can just have a seat oh, around here and chat. It's kind of, uh, you know, waiting area. For yeah. Guests. Yeah. Sometimes uh, when we are setting up in the boardroom, maybe the doors aren't quite open yet. So then you can just uh, kind of network and gather out here and talk to each other. Good. All right. So let's get outside. Keep going. Okay. All right, so this middle portion of the offices also have our some brands, but we also have interview rooms, which I know you'll be conducting interview with later. Uh, we have a VIP room here. We also have some interview rooms with um, our speakers from FinTech for Good, as well as OVOU. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. I want to take you down here further. Okay. So here we have another boardroom. This is a smaller boardroom where we're hosting the Kajun Art 3D VR area. And you can see that we decorate it with his latest artwork. Well, that's cool, huh? That's, yeah. uh, that's the latest work, huh? That's his latest work. And um, here, I can show you this picture over here on this wall. Uh, that's uh, John D. Rockefeller. He lived in that, he's in that cabin with his birthplace. And these painting, this painting is painted on wooden remote boards from his cabin. So the only remaining boards left, uh, Kaojun was able to create these uh, great visual artwork. Wow, that's amazing. And that works a lot. Huh? Yeah, yeah. That um, was of, you know, history, you know, family latency and, uh, you know, a lot of, well, come on, a lot of value over there. Oh, absolutely. Value, sentimental value, actual uh, monetary value. And it's just, it's just so great. It's just looks so beautiful as well. Yes. All right, so I'm going to show you over here. Oh, it looks like in that little area here, we have the Mexico group learning. So one of our Mexico, in Mexico. Okay, yeah, so they're, they're <laughs> so they're actually speaking Spanish. Uh, one of our intern is uh, hosting this um, group learning where she she's a Spanish speaker. So she's got these students with her as well who wants to learn about uh, what we do learn about this 3D immersive world, about how we're doing everything online now. So yeah, so she's got a, a little group going on here and we do that, we can host that in this office space. Ah, cool, okay. All right, here, here in this room number 10 is Min and her friends. This uh, Min Kwan is our founder and she here, you can see a picture of her with um, Kaojun artist. Yeah, she's got a picture with Kaojun, the artist on the right, and Rockefeller Jr. on the left. Mm -hmm. If we go inside, mm -hmm. could you go inside with me? So here um, is a picture of her uh, at the Rotary Club. She is a director for the Vancouver Rotary Club, so she participates and does a lot of work with them. Yeah, yeah, well. I participated recently, you know, introduced by me. Also. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a great, it's a great organization. Yeah. And you can see this is another event she attended. I think it was in 2017. And you can see Rockefeller Jr. right beside her as well. And I believe the one. <laughs> yeah. And that's Cassie. I know. Her. Oh, so you know these people. That's great. <laughs> All right, so let me see. Um, you know what? I would love to introduce you and talk to you more about iCash Rewards. So if you would like to follow me into the iCash Rewards office, I want to uh, talk to you, okay? Okay. Okay, so just go this way. Oops. So this office is already configured into a nice seating area. Join me. Oh. 
Hi, I'm over here. Hi. I'm over here. Hi. We also have another group um, led by another one of our intern, uh, Ali, where this is the WeChat learning group, uh, where he is teaching them about this uh, new wave uh, digital marketing channel called WeChat channel. And these are the people that would like to learn about it today. Alakala, did you, can you find me? Hello? All right. So I'm just gonna wait for him. You might have had a bit of a technical issue, but I'm gonna go inside here. And this room is already configured to be a great uh, seating area. You can configure it into an actual desk, into a meeting or just empty spaces that we have seen. And I'm gonna take a seat, just click on one of the chairs and you can sit down. So let me do this presentation. All right. So it is my pleasure to introduce iCash Rewards and the iCash Rewards VR Center. It is a trusted partner in digital marketing. The iCash Rewards VR Center is in an immersive 3D world for work, learning and virtual events and virtual shopping experience. So iCash Rewards, what is it? It is a digital one network business, a new generation social e-commerce marketing and rewards platform. It is a leading provider of online shopping digital rewards platform and solutions and connecting merchants and consumers across the globe. iCash Rewards is a web and mobile based plugin that gives online shoppers cashback rewards in the form of cashback or USDT, which is another form of cryptocurrency. So iCash Rewards 3.0 has added feature on member networking, global payment, cross-border social e-commerce function, and a virtual immersive shopping experience. Signing up online is very simple. All you need is an email and a password. As you can see, we are running a holiday sale happening right now until the end of the year, until the end of 2020. So just by signing up right now, you'll get instantly receive 1000 iCash reward points. You can zoom in on this here. And for every referral that you make, you'll get another additional 500 points. And so it's very easy to collect points and in turn, get your cash back. iCash Rewards has many brand partners, including Microsoft, GoDaddy. Hi, Lakala. I was just starting to do a little presentation here. Would you like to have a seat on one of the chairs? So iCash Rewards has many brand partners, including Microsoft, GoDaddy, Booking.com, Groupon, Wix, Rebella, Forio, Shoppers Drug Mart, Indigo, David's Tea, just to name a few. They actually have over 150 more brands in its portfolio. Using the iCash Rewards platform, you can search for brands or by categories, whether you want to search tech and electronic, health and beauty, or Bitcoin or fine art. Whatever you're looking for, you can shop on iCash Rewards and you earn points. Every Friday, we do host an appointment-based showing of Kaojun's artwork, a world-renowned artist. So we welcome you to set up an appointment with us if you're interested in viewing fine art and connect with the artist virtually. You can check out more about Kaojun on his fine art page on iCash Rewards. iCash Rewards is an e-commerce social marketing platform with global connectivity. When you sign up, you will receive 1,000 iCash loyalty points instantly. You can connect with global users from all and all the members on the iCash platforms. As a member, you can comment and like articles. You can connect with other members and many more features. So sign up and check out iCash Rewards today. Our holiday sale promotion runs until the end of the year, end of 2020. It features some of our favorite brands, including Shoppers Drug Mart, Illy Coffee, David's Tea, each brand has its own showroom here on the iCash Rewards VR Center. 
on this floor. So if you have any questions about shopping online, you can visit the showrooms and feel free to ask our staff for help. So thank you for joining me today. And we would love to invite you to join our social network by following us on various social media platforms. You can screenshot this page. Uh, we have Twitter, our website, our LinkedIn, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, Slack, and Telegram. So please follow us and it can lead you to more information and more products online. Well, that's totally cool. Um, so uh, besides this, you know, a uh, English, you know, um, social, uh, social network platform, you have some Chinese, you know, uh, social network platform. Yes, we do. We have a very active WeChat group. Uh, we have several WeChat groups. So if you're interested in joining our WeChat group as well, we'd be happy to have you join us. I think I can put up that information maybe later on the video on the link below. Um, we also have WeChat channel, which is one of the latest and most glorious new marketing, uh, uh, marketing platform nowadays, right? Yes. Okay, cool. So, um, all right. So, um, yeah, you are welcome to uh, go interview some of the uh, speakers that we have. We have three speakers here today. Um, you can, do you know where the rooms are? I can take you to them. I, I, I think I know them, you know, uh, it's just somewhere around here, right? Yeah. Why don't I take so you the to- first will be uh, Mr. Shaochan or? I think it's Riza. So just down here. Here he is. So this is. And I will tell you why you cannot. Okay. Hi. Hi. is here. Looks like you finished. Yeah. So um, Lakala should be coming in, and he's going to be doing some interviews. Okay. Good. Welcome, Lakala. Here is Lisa. Hi. Hi. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you, gentlemen. Huh. All right. So. Uh, Lakala will be speaking with Risa first, and I will go and talk to some other people. So we're interested in learning about some of the takeaways that we can get from all these speakers that we have here today. He has a postdoctoral in electrical and electronics engineering. From UBC, he has over 25 years of education and research in math, STEM, AI, computational ge geometry, and computer vision. Hi. Hi, Dr. Zhang. Oh. Hey, you are. Hello. Hi. How are you today? Good, good, good. Uh, well, we would just want to say thank you for co-organizing uh, the Digital 2020 event with us. We're very appreciative of you and we're happy that you can join us. Um, now we are very close to the end of the year, the end of 2020 and the end of our three month long event. I was wondering if I can ask you for some takeaways, one or two takeaways. What do you think we need to pay attention to in the new year in 2021? Or is there anything that you're with us? Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Did you hear me? I not the last few. <laughs> oh, sorry. I think my uh, my speaker is a bit weird today. But I was just wondering, um, if there anything that you can give us, like we should pay attention to in the new year, in terms of like. Uh, what this year 2020 has taught us okay so so anyway like a, it's kind of like a a big shock for everybody right, right yes. in 2020, right but like a, the good thing is like we can learn from crisis mm -hmm. um like for example like even from my side like for from my business um it's a good opportunity called like a we learn like uh, when anything happen, they can like with, like, uh, with our staff, our employee, our instructor, 
like parents and students, right? So, cause like in the future, like definitely like online education is kind of like a very important issue. So, so like we, 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 we actually, we, we prepared for that before and we tested it before, but nobody, nobody like imagine like a, it comes so fast, right? Yeah. But like yeah. for everybody, it's a it's a already a good opportunity. So we try a lot of stuff like in advance. Yeah. So like in the future, we as we know, like a, like with, with the technology like AI, right? Like with like a STEM, like a, like a other new technology. So like like online online working online education. Will, will be natural. It, yes. it's, it's, it, it's not like a, it's not like hundred percent, but it, it should be like a a very important like way to, yeah. to work together, right? So 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 anyway, twenty twenty, some good, some bad, right? Like <laughs> so, we all we already start to 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 to, to try to initiate and to to imp, to implement to practice. So I will see, like we have to anything. There's like a, some good, some good, good side, some bad side, right? So we have to learn some good from bad. So That's this is true. what I want to see. That's good. That's very optimistic. I really like it. Thank you so much for sharing. <laughs> You're very welcome. Okay, I'm gonna move on. I'm gonna go visit another speaker. So thank you again and uh, ha enjoy yourself. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. All right, here is our other speaker, um, Xiao Chen Zhang from FinTech for Good. He is the president of FinTech for Good. Um, let's go and talk to him. He has been working with us since 2017, so we're very fortunate to have his consistent support for, with us. 第二个呢，就是这个Fanny过来了。Hi，Fanny。Hi，Fanny。How uh, you can see the colors there, Min is there, and you're right there. You look blue right. suit. <laughs> yeah, Min chose the photo, and she's the best in, in, in everything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was it's great. So, so I'm here today because we have an event happening, and it's called the 2020 Learnings You Need to Heed heading into 2021. So I was wondering if you can give me some takeaways uh, one or two about what uh, about our topic what we can take from this year to go into next year <laughs> whether it's uh, whether it's about you know on-site event transitioning onto online event and a 3d virtual event or whatever topic you want to share so I'm happy sure. to hear <laughs> Yeah, and uh, just uh, starting from the virtual events, uh, I think it's really uh, very exciting that, you know, uh, uh, as for the, uh, uh, where do I start? Yeah, and uh, you know, in the, past, in the past few years that we organized many events mm -hmm. and uh, I my life was at hell and I travel like a, you know, seventy percent of my time was traveling because of the event, and I was in different countries. And uh, you know, it, at that time, that uh, people just uh, feel comfortable. Uh, Even now, that people still prefer face-to-face -face event. Yeah. But uh, because of COVID nineteen, it's not possible. And then all everyone just have the second best choice, and then move the event online. And now that I actually enjoy so much more of you know <laughs> online events than the face-to-face -face. the reason is very simple you know i as we are talking and I, i'm with my baby <laughs> and i can take up the family 
and uh, while I'm still just getting things done, and this is much more efficient. And then, you know, move events from a pure online event to a 3D immersed experience. And I think that's also a huge improvement. Like, you know, here now that I'm talking to you, but uh, I'm talking to also to your avatar, Fanny. And I, 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 I'm, although it's, uh, you know, virtual, yeah. but I feel like you are sitting, you know, next to me and we have this Facebook this conversation. Yeah, this that's true. This is so much better. Yeah. Yeah, and we can actually have multiple people in here talking at the same time if we wanted to, right? Yeah, exactly. And uh, then, you know, from the learning side, I think it's also very exciting with the 3D environment where that's, uh, you know, learning is always uh, just the uh, learners are looking for, you know, uh, not only the, the content, but also they want to make the learning fun. Oh. <laughs> With the, with the 3D virtual platform and where that I think, you know, the learning is becoming much more fun. Yeah. And especially when we talk about, uh, you know, young learners uh, whose attention span is really uh, short. For and sure. if, uh, you know, they just uh, use a Zoom or, or any, you know, other platform and then they probably will just lose interest very quickly. But with the, you know, this... Uh, avatar 3d and then they feel like they are in a classroom and then they speak to people who are next to them mm -hmm. and this will just you know inspire more learners to stay uh, longer and uh, be more focused i think that's definitely is something which is going to be useful uh next year that's great thank you that that's very interesting and thanks for sharing with us <laughs> i do i do enjoy uh attending these events online as well. And I think the 3D aspect, the virtual immersive world that we're in, it's just, and it's very cool. Absolutely, yeah. And uh, another interesting thing is that, you know, from next year that uh, we'll continue move a lot of our learning and also our event online. Mm -hmm. And I think uh, this uh, trend, no matter we have vaccine or not, people just enjoy, uh, you know, this flexibility. And I think this will, it's, it's not a COVID-19 phenomenon. Yeah. This, will, this will continue after COVID-19, yeah. Yeah, and it cuts down on travel time. Exactly, <laughs> and also cost the time mm -hmm. and flexibility and, uh, you know, family time is all just uh, very good. And uh, again, the 3D just uh, add a great value to make this fun, yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much for sharing your insight. Um, enjoy yourself in your office. I'll be going around as well. And thank you again for talking to me. Have a great day. Thank you. Bye. Bye. That was very insightful. So next, uh, we do have Riza here. Oh, it looks like he's still in the middle of his chat with Lakala. So, um, so I'm going to take you down actually onto this end of the office space. I oh, have a very big office space here. And surprisingly, I'm not tired, even though I've been in heels all day. So here is Kaojun Art uh, Showroom Exhibition Area. Let me see if I can get a good shot. So on this side, on the right hand side is Kaojun's blue exhibition. So all of his, uh, his blue series will be in here. So I'm gonna take you inside to one of the rooms. And you can view his art in each of the rooms here. Uh, you'll get an, a different piece of art from his blue series. And you can go and get closer look into his artwork. And there's also a video in each of these rooms. So on the right hand side is his blue series and on the left hand side is his Lotus series. <coughs> Again, you can go into each of these rooms and take a close look at his art. 
And there's also a video that um, I'll just play you a very short video about his art. I'm gonna turn the volume down a bit. Everything is yours alone. Every day. So you can come and check out his art exhibit on the left and right hand side at this end down here. So I'm gonna go and see if Riza is available now. Oh, there he is. He is available. So I just want to introduce him. He is a third generation entrepreneur. So he knows the value of connections. As a first generation immigrant, Riza also knows the reality of starting over and needing to rebuild and to build a network from scratch. So let's go and chat with him. Hi, Riza. Hi, Tani. How are you today? Good, good. The, the topic of today's event, it was the similar to last, uh, last time. And I just wanted to kind of get your takeaways, something like an advice that you can give heading into the next year. Because in about three weeks, it's the end of 2020. So, yes, so correct. yeah, so we're just wondering, like, what, what would you think uh, we should know or do from what we've learned from this year as we head into the next year? Is there any kind of uh, overall takeaway you can give me? Um, I'm going to speak on personal mm. uh, experience as opposed to uh, general advice. Mm. Um, what I did prior to pandemic, the, the entire networking that I did, and two weeks ago I explained, I shared my story of going to 100 networking events in 100 days. That alone helped me go through the pandemic and the COVID situation. So when we have a crisis like this, mm -hmm community and the network we built before are, is going to help us. And it's too late when, uh, when um, it's not too late, it's just the, the more you build it, the more it will come to your rescue. So I, I don't think this is the only crisis we're gonna see in our lifetime. Usually every, every lifetime in 60 years, you're gonna see two, three, uh, crisis like this. Uh, we saw 2000 internet bubble, then we saw 2008, yes. the world crisis, then now. So if we're going to have more of this, it's very important for people to build their network and social capital. Um, hence why I, I talk about social capital a lot. So going into 2000, 2021, one of the biggest uh, advice I have is to build your network from uh, reaching out to existing connections you have, reach out to some of those LinkedIn people that you have in message, uh, reconnect with, with the existing network that you have, all the way to jumping on opportunities on Zoom calls, on events, on Virbala, and network. That networking piece um, is going to help your business in ways that you, can, you can't imagine. There is no number or ROI that you can attach to that. That's very good. That's very interesting. And I really enjoyed your presentation last week and the 100, day, 100 events in 100 days. That is an amazing story. <laughs> yeah, I was very, uh, I'm, I'm very honored to, to have the opportunity to, to share my story. Um, it's something that I learned a lot and, and I'm glad that other people can learn from. Thank you so much. Um, uh, I'm going to speak to Min and see uh, what the next plan is for you. So thank yeah. you for your patience. And we really appreciate no you being here and you sharing your stories, your advice and everything. It's just kind of what we're doing here is, you know, we are trying to connect other people as well. And it just, everything just goes so swell together. <laughs> yes. Thank so, you. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Um, I'll be right back. Okay. Okay. No worries. All right, so I'm going to take you here. I think the event here is almost concluding. So before I leave, I just want to mention how um, this uh, space here is, this website here is the Macmillan Museum of Art from Boston College. And it's hosting, it's been showcasing Couchin's art since last year. And you can see more from the website and 
we again encourage you to explore our 3D virtual immersive world at our virtual our VR center up here. Do some shopping, do some networking, look at some art, um, make your time at home uh, in front of the computer more interactive by heading into our 3D immersive world. So thank you again for joining me and I hope you've enjoyed this um, live stream today. I hope you've enjoyed all the things that we've seen and um, don't forget to check us out next time and uh, go on our website for more information and we'll see you soon. Take care. Bye.